it's got a bit of X Factor. You're gonna go through to boot camp! A splash of drama. <laughs> and a lot of silly stuff. What's your name, sorry? What's your name for me? Right, that's him. I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just... Nativity 2 is a British film all about Christmas. It follows Mr. Poppy and his class of unruly kids to Wales as they try and win a big singing competition. But this time they've got a new teacher, an actor who's played a travelling Time Lord before. But even he admits it was chaos on set. Thank you. The film's improvised, which means we didn't have a script. You know, usually you know exactly who's going to say what when. I'm at the front of the class trying to control it, yeah. I spent a day in a school watching how the real teachers do it uh, to see if uh, I could pick up any tips. Making a movie without a script is very unusual. And add to that the fact that most of the cast had only done a bit of acting before on school nativity plays. What was it like to act alongside all these kids then that, that haven't really done much acting before? It was great fun because they're just so spontaneous. You have no idea what they're going to say, what they're going to do. Whatever you say as a grown-up performer, they respond to it. Adults need to perhaps learn a lot from them because if we can watch little people and learn how they respond in the moment, I think we'd all be a bit happier. Lots of the school kids were in the first film and have returned for more mayhem. Ten-year-old Ben Wilby was just seven on the first movie and his career has kicked off ever since. Here he is entertaining kids in hospital in between his acting, stand-up comedy and mingling with megastars. You've met Tom Cruise. And you just bumped into him and said, oh, hi. And I had to look down on him because he's, you know, small. <laughs> For Ben and his cast of kids, this will be an extra special Christmas. And who knows, they might be back for more sequels in the future. Saturday.